everybody, it's Hannah for Nerd Caliber at OhioCon here, and I have Deborah. Deborah, what are you cosplaying as today? I'm cosplaying as Kiki from Kiki's Delivery Service. So why did you decide to do Kiki from Kiki's Delivery Service? Um, it's actually one of my favorite Miyazaki films, and I think it's a really interesting story of um, a girl who's growing up and learns to live on her own. So I just thought it was really, it's a cute movie, and it's, it has good values as well. Have you watched it like ever since you were little and you just like kind of grew up with it or? Yeah, pretty much. The first time I ever saw it was when I was in elementary school and it was on the Disney Channel and I had to know what it was. So I looked it up and I am really into Miyazaki now. So so wonderful. I love everything yeah. that he does. Um, so can you tell me a little bit about how you made the outfit or how you put like the broom together and everything? Yeah. <laughs> Well, the broom was actually really hard. Um, it was two brooms, and I had to take it apart. And brooms are surprisingly difficult to take apart. I'd imagine it falls apart really easily. <laughs> well, there's a lot of wire involved that I wasn't. I had no idea that would be involved. But um, anyway, also I did Gigi, and he is he's fully posable. So I did him on a like a wire frame, and I felted him. So oh, see, yeah. I was wondering. I was like, did you yeah. buy that from someone in like the artist alley or the dealer's room? But you actually sewed the little yeah, cat. Yeah, I, oh, it's called gosh. needlepoint felting, and it's it's really nice. It's it's a good way to get things done if you don't know how to sew plushes. And then the dress, I don't know how to sew, so I had to have help. But we ended up doing a pattern, and it came out like this. So. And you just got it fitted and someone just helped you sew it? Yeah. And did you just like buy everything. the bow from somewhere or no, did you put wires in it this. as well? Yeah, I put a wire on it and I put like a headband in, a, in red fabric and, and just sewed it on there. So yeah. So what the, what was like the hardest thing? I guess, I'm guessing the broom was the, yeah, was the, the hardest <laughs> thing about making the that. The hardest thing was definitely the broom. Yep. <laughs> I mean, uh, do you plan on doing any other cosplays? In the, uh, from the show or from the movie at all? Any other Miyazaki ones? Um, I was thinking about doing San from uh, Mononoke Hime, but um, maybe next year. I don't know if I'll get it in this year. <laughs> I mean, well, what's your favorite part about cosplaying in general? Um, my favorite part is just being able to interact with other people who are cosplayers. You kind of have that sort of next level bond and it's it's just awesome. Yeah. Meeting characters that are like yourself or other people who share the same like interests just like you do. Right. <laughs> so um, why do you come to like Ohio Con or any other con like this one? Well it's just a great place to meet new people. So like I said, um, I really like the culture of like cosplay and a lot of anime and just Japanese culture in general and I just feel like it's a really good place to go. It's like the perfect want. place yeah, to meet much. up with other people. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Same interest. I mean, it's like having instant friends, and you can just go anywhere and talk to anybody. 